Hello, welcome to FIMA Prial FIA Made Easy Series. In this series, we would like to share you, with you our FIMAP exper experience, giving you some hints to perform RIA, uh, FIA on the easy way. Today, we will uh, continue with FIMAP tools used for modeling of FIA assembly connections as part 3. As mentioned in, in uh, parts 1 and 2, FIMAP um, offers different type of connector, connectors for modeling of FIA assemblies. Connections can be defined between surfaces, edges and points with or without friction and used in both um, linear and nonlinear computation. To another group, connector group belong uh, bolts and fasteners, which define the local connections between model parts. Both bolts and fasteners can be modeled by solid and line elements. Going for solid bolt modeling, some important steps should be followed before connection definition. Before definition of bolt connection regions, the model geometry should be prepared for efficient and successful identification of potential connection regions using, for example, geometry editing tools as well as geometry carved from surface project, the connection region should be predefined. This will help to limit contact areas and define both connections to location where really contacts occur. Geometry of solid bolts and nuts will be meshed using tetrahedra solid elements while the, the rest of geometry, if possible, using hexahedral elements. Hexahedral elements are less stiff, on this way give them give more accurate results, especially when uh, nonlinear contact behavior is evaluated. Let us see how it can be done in the following FEMA example. The following FIMAP model consists of solid geometry. In this case, we are going to model bolt connections using solid elements. Before connection definitions, some geometry preparation will be done first. For the uh, uh, bolt heads and nuts, the automatic washer generations will be used to define the connection regions and the contact locations. If you look at this comment right now, uh, select split solid for as a new features in FIMAP 12. Mm. And you can observe that we've got very nice um, uh, washer through all our uh, connected parts. Uh, for definition of the second bolt head connections region, solid embed phase comment can be used uh, after a uh, curve projection and connected surface from the bolt head edge are created. So we uh, created first a uh, project uh, um, lines, curves on the surface under the uh, bolt and uh, the second uh, step is the actually a solid embed phase. Those uh, parts are uh, divided right now. All model geometry, which can be hex meshed, will be divided for um, generation of hexahedral elements. As mentioned earlier, uh, they are less stiff. Finally, all solid connectors must be created using, for example, connect automatic. automatic. If you need to add some additional contact properties, you can create new connection property and uh, use uh, a connections editor to control the properties for the parts uh, that we are talking about different connections properties. After that, we are going to run uh, both tetrahedral and hexahedral meshing together, la run uh, for loads and constraints, and evaluate our results. Um, using, of course, 
in uh, groups we can uh, very simply identify our results for for example bolts nuts uh, separately and together when we are now going to exchange our bolts uh, as uh, solids and instead of them we are going to um, generate fasteners using custom tools meshing and uh, hold to hold fasteners we can obtain similar results for this model having the line elements as a bolts FEMAP connections tools used for definition of FEA model connections help with efficient model of FEA assemblies. For more information, please check chapters 441 and chapter 12.9 from FEMAP help folder or contact us using email femapsupport at femcom.se. Thank you for watching.